Well, nuclear power has had a, a difficult history. Of course, uh, uh, in the 60s and 70s, we had a boom in nuclear power around the world. Uh, everybody hoped uh, the famous phrase was it was going to be too cheap to meter. Uh, but then, of course, we had the accidents at Three Mile Island in the United States and the very serious accident uh, in Chernobyl in the Ukraine, and that really uh, set the industry back dramatically. Uh, we had reached a point until very recently where we had not actually done a new grassroots nuclear reactor for 30 years. But now there is talk of a global nuclear renaissance, and whether it's as uh, grandiose in the United States as some people would believe, it certainly is going to be worldwide. Uh, the Chinese uh, uh, have 24 reactors under construction, another 100 planned. The Indians have very vigorous uh, uh, programs for the future. The Russians, uh, there's growing interest in the Middle East and the United Arab Emirates, Saudi Arabia, Egypt. So we're going to see this. The big question in my mind is as we expand nuclear power, uh, we need to make sure we do it in a way that uh, we not only do it safely, obviously, but we also need to be, I think, of growing concern about enhanced risks of nuclear weapons proliferation, that the civilian nuclear technology not be misused in any way. And as we have more of these sensitive facilities potentially for what we call uranium enrichment and reprocessing, which are part of the fuel cycle, uh, which you need for atomic civilian power. But once you have one or both of those technologies, you de facto have the capability of making a weapon. And I don't think most of us are going to worry, you know, if, if developed countries that are considered highly stable uh, expand nuclear power. But as we start moving nuclear reactors into the Middle East and other politically volatile regions of the world, we certainly want to make sure that all the vendors that sell this equipment are as vigilant as possible to make sure that somehow under a dual-use item that's said to be used for one thing, that it can't be used for another. And it's a very, very serious problem.